dude that dropped another freaking video, bro. Three, two, one. Let's go. The only thing slower than the DMV Man. is YouTube responding to a problem. When it comes to YouTube addressing a situation or fixing an issue, they take the scenic route. Most of the time, it's just wildly inefficient. It feels like their strategy for handling problems or issues is just to cross their fingers, close their eyes, plug their ears, and just pray that whatever the problem is, it doesn't result in a viral tweet. What the hell are you talking about? Because that seems to be the only kryptonite to Superman here. That is the only time YouTube's arm is ever twisted enough to finally... Bro, based on what I'm hearing, Mr. Penguins wants speed banned, bro. This dude wants speed banned. I understand what he did, but it was a mistake, bro. Address or rectify something. At least that's the way it has been for a long time. I do think they are getting a bit better at it. But in the case of I show speed here with the situation that happened yesterday, I have never seen YouTube move this fast. In the 17 years said? I've been on the platform, I have never seen this side of YouTube. They fired on the turbo jets. Well, what color is your brigade? They engaged the NOS boosters in order to quickly explain what's going on with the whole iShow speed situation. I'll go ahead and bring you up to speed on the lore, just in case you don't know what the uh, what the situation is. iShow Speed again, is YouTube's bro. biggest streamer, and yesterday while streaming Five Nights at Freddy's, like bro, like bro, oh you bringing this up, bro, oh, against to so many people. Oh, man. Look how many oh, views man. you got on the freaking so previous asshole. video. You think people missed out and forgot what he did? No. What the freak is you mentioning it for again, bro? The freak. The freak is wrong with you, little bro. He's, he really rocked out with his cock out. He got. Bro, think he funny. Rock out with his cock. Out. Like, bro. Got a jump scare from Chica, which resulted in him thrusting at the webcam until his dick flopped out. I tell you, those damn Five Nights at Freddy's animatronics are so quirky that sometimes penis will just come out of nowhere. But yeah, I show speed was overreacting to the jump scare for the sake of entertaining his audience, and then he took it to the next level by saying that he wants to fuck Chica and started thrusting at the webcam and then it was for his entertainment purposes. Just ended up on stream and flashed the entire audience, which of course became a huge story online and a huge question mark as to what would happen next. A lot of people are wondering if YouTube was gonna give him a strike or if they're gonna outright ban his channel because nudity is against their rules. And YouTube has swiftly come out to answer this I mean, question. Yeah, YouTube today, says bro. that they're not going to I ban speed, him bro. or- I show speed won't be banned on YouTube after viral wardrobe malfunction. And listen, I'm gonna tell you why they won't ban him. They're not gonna ban him no matter what. He's carrying their platform. He's carrying the platform right now, bro. As you- as you notice, this dude is carrying the platform. This dude is the GOAT of streaming, bro. I don't care. He is the GOAT. That's why he's the GOAT! The GOAT! Better than Corey Kenshin, better than Mr. Beast, he is GOAT. They're not gonna ban him. They know what he is worth. Anything like that, or even give him a strike. It'll just be business as usual, he's oh, fine shit, to get- What does that say? The internet superstar was horrified after his junk was shown on camera, repeatedly saying, oh my god, and abruptly ending the stream. Continue moving forward on the horrified, platform bro. as he has he been. They stated that while it was a violation of their policy, the fact that Speed removed the broadcast and everything associated with it means that he was in the clear. Which to me makes me think that YouTube actually factored in that it was an accident. I it highly an doubt accident. he wanted to become known as I Show Meat as a result from all of this. Oh, I don't think oh, it was a premeditated I... cock jump scare. Now, I said this in the last video, but I'm going to mention it again here, and it's something everyone else has mentioned as well. I Show Speed's main audience is on the younger side of things. There's a lot of kids that watch him. Plus, he was streaming Five Nights at Freddy's. Mr. Penguin, do I look like a kid to you? Do I look like a kid to you, Mr. Penguin? Do I look like a kid to you? No. Which is a horror franchise that has a very large audience with younger viewers. So I really don't think the argument of this potentially being on purpose for the sake of attention and publicity is a strong argument. Like, I don't think there's any world where Speed actually planned to expose himself in front of this audience playing this game. Didn't mean it, because if he did, that would be it. the stupidest idea ever, and he would probably be looking at a much more serious case than just a potential strike on YouTube. Didn't mean it, bro. So I he highly doubt that this was a scheme. That's a fact. I 
really don't think that this idea crossed his mind for content like I'm going to throw my meat at the webcam and it's going to it's going to generate all kinds of headlines. Like I I just really don't think that he was did the case. Not mean it. And I think YouTube gets the same impression that it wasn't no! because I don't think usually they would allow this to be just a squeaky clean, you know, go forward and don't do it again type situation. Because I recall a few times in the past there have been channels that have uploaded either softcore pornography or just full-blown porn. And even though they removed the content, based strikes for it or just outright termination. So the fact that they're not doing either of those in the speed case makes me believe that they actually did have a human review of the situation here and eventually deemed that it wasn't on purpose, thus they shouldn't be super harsh with the policy enforcement here. I don't think this is the norm with their nudity policy. I don't think people are going to be able to get away with you know, pretending that something was accidental. Like if you're doing a stream, for example, I go live right now, I take off all my clothes, I'm bare ass naked, and I start juggling my balls at the webcam before going offline. I don't think what I can get away freak? with deleting that footage and then Why being okay. I'm sure I would probably face a strike bare minimum because I had planned to do that and broadcast, knowingly broadcast content that violates the YouTube terms. Whereas here, it doesn't seem like that was ever the plan. It seemed like what Speed wanted was an over-the-top, loud reaction that went out of control. Overall, I'm pretty extreme. surprised that it didn't even result in a strike. YouTube's not exactly a platform that's known for its leniency when it comes to their rules. They never take context and consideration when it comes to anything with their policies. They've always shown themselves to be cutthroat, no mercy, and won't even listen to your side of a situation. So... I was stunned to see that this resulted in them just being like, hey, you know, it happens. Carry on. But anyway, that's the most recent update on this whole story. But I do want to give a quick mention to a really degenerate clip that I just saw floating around about Aiden Ross's response to this. Bro, I, I, guys, stop talking about What the freak did I just say not even a minute ago? I like the dude gonna mention they still either I like the dude gonna mention they still either. This dude is gonna bring up Aiden. I've seen it Yo. thousands of times. I've known Speed for years. I've seen it in person thousands of times. I don't care. I saw it and I laughed. I smiled. I don't care, bro. Hey. Um, I show Speed hey, just Yo. turned 18. He just turned 18 this year. And Aiden is saying that he's oh, seen his that. penis in person thousands bro, of Speed times. Speed is not 18. Speed is like 24. What the fuck, man? I don't know if he's just trying to make some kind of weird pedophile joke about himself or... If he's just being totally... I'm like, this penguin, bro, is about to get on my freaking nerves. He's dragging it right now, bro. This dude wants... This is the type of people to get speed banned, bro. Honest, Why? going mask off about seeing a kid's penis thousands of times over the years that he's known Does him? This dude not know what sarcasm Why would is? you have seen a child's penis thousands of times? It makes it seem like you were grooming him. Like, the only way Speed could stay your friend was if he kept showing you his wiener or something like that with the way you're speaking about it. It is scary. That's some frightening shit. Again, I don't know if this was supposed to be a joke, but if it was, that is a weird one to make. That's, that's setting off all kinds of uh, alarm bells, red buzzers blaring. That is a big old self-report there. That is a joke that you couldn't torture someone enough to make, seeing a miner's penis thousands of times. Meanwhile, Aiden's just openly stating it, admitting to it, with a big old smile on his face, bouncing up and down it's in his seat, and forgetting to share the it information that he's apparently buddy. seen I Show Speed's penis thousands of times over the years he, bro, before he was 18. It, bro. You're dragging creepy. it, bro. He's trying Very to get creepy. Aiden's but anyway, yeah, canceled. that's really about the uh, whole update on the situation as of right now. That's about it. See ya. Let me know if y'all saw the um speed live today. The ending was very horrible. Stop calling him my show me, bro. Like, come on, bro. Be better. It's been your boy Demon Energy. Don't forget to like the video, and I'm out. Deuces.